Hey everybody, Randy coming back at you with FPV Trends and today I want to make an update video on one of my previous videos where I talked about fast charging the Avada batteries. Uh, in this video I'm going to show you an updated version that I use and, uh, and where you can get it at. So let's get started with the video. So originally uh, I had gotten this one here. Um, this is the USB-C fast charger. It's the uh, what is it? The Sacrack, I guess I'm saying that right. S A C R A C K, Sacrack 100 watt compact six port USB C charging station. Now, this one only has uh 20 watts on it, so it's 20 watt, 20 watt, 20 watt, and then 10, 10, 10. Um, so what I found was is first of all, when just using a regular brick to charge the Avada batteries and the goggles batteries. Now I'm not talking about the remote batteries. The remote batteries, the motion controller and this controller, you've got to charge at five watts or less because it's a different type of battery inside of here, okay? And in case you're wondering where I'm getting all this information from, I got it directly from DJI. I contacted their technical support and they explained all this to me. So those you have to charge differently. You have to charge them slower. But the Avada batteries and the goggles batteries can be charged up to 65 watts, okay? So when you're charging on a regular brick, you're typically charging at five watts. I was finding that it was taking somewhere around the three to four hour mark, and you could be seeing some different results depending on the brick uh, and, and the length of cable you use. But I was seeing in the three to four hour range. With this particular one here at 20 watts, uh, what I found was is it was taking about two hours to charge them. So I cut the time down by about an hour, hour and a half, maybe two hours. So this is a good little charger to have, and I'll leave a link in the description below for this particular charger if you want to get it. Uh, it's not that expensive. At the time of this uh, video, it was $39.99, okay? So I'll leave it to this. But I went ahead and got this one here. Uh, so let's see, what is the name of this one? This one is, well, I don't know the name of it, and it doesn't say the name of it. Isn't that crazy? They don't put a name on anything. Anyway, this is a 170 watt charger total, but it has a 65 watt port up here. So when I charge the batteries at, actually it's this one. Yeah, it's this port right here, <laughs> 60, 65 watts. I don't know if you can see that or not. I don't know if it'll focus in, but anyway, it's 65 watts. So when I charge at 65 watts, I'm charging the Avada battery in about 37 minutes. Uh, to 40 minutes, depending on how low, you know, if you run it down to 20% or 22% or whatever. But I'm seeing it in less than 45 minutes. Let's just put it that way. So this is actually a good little charger to have. Now, unfortunately, at the time of making this video, they no longer have these. They're out of stock uh, in, in these particular ones right here. So I found another version that also has a, let me just go over here and look, also has a 65 watt port on it. Uh, and at the time of this video, it's $44.99. So you can see it's not that much difference between the two or between that one over there. Uh, so I will leave a link in the description below for this other one that I found that is in stock. But I'm also going to leave a link in the description for this one just in case it comes back into stock and you're watching this video in the future and you want this particular brand here. So anyway, that being said, hope you liked this video. If you did, please be sure to subscribe to the channel as we're trying to grow. And be sure to like the video as well. And until next time, stay safe, fly safe, and I'll see you on the flip side.